Welcome back team. You're Gaming with the Colonel and this is Strategic Command WW2 World at War. The continuing multiplayer series versus Mr. Harry Smith. Uh, before we get started, I would like to let everybody know that I will soon be playing uh, another game as the Allies against Old Crow Balthazar or Mike. Uh oh, I might be losing that guy. Yep, that's too bad. I need to keep that city though. Alright, guy, hold on. Hold on. Oh no, kind of top history. That's going to blow chunks. I have to come off that line a little bit. I'm not sure. Thank you for retreating me. I appreciate that. Oh, no. Look at that. We have them coming in. finally got me out of there. <clears throat> I don't know if that was worth the additional, I don't know, 30 or 40 that I spent on that, but it did delay him a turn from moving all those carriers. Ooh, well, there goes that. Finally got a hold of that one because he attacked from two sides. If he doesn't move into Battle of Vostok, am I in Battle of Vostok? Am I going to make it in there? Nope. Looks like no. Well, hopefully it's I can use the... Uh, how did he get in there? Oh no, not my battleship. Oh, that's bad news. That is bad news. Okay, he's bringing all kinds of carriers over there. All manner of carriers. Come on, let that be all. Not good, not good, not good at all. Killing me in port. No! Oh, that was bad news. That was going to be my surprise. He found it. Oh, and it's over. Is it over? Do I, do I surrender? Oh, this is so not good. I think it's over, people. I left it empty one too many times. That's unfortunate because I was doing quite well there in Europe, I think, and uh, that would have been okay. Boy, there were a lot of lessons learned in this game, weren't there? But that one right there, that's brutal. He came in, got on to uh, Tokyo and one other major thing, plus sunk that battleship, which I could have absorbed that, but the rest of this is, is not going to go well. I got no units left in Japan. Thought I did fairly well over there. Do they uh, surrender or do they not? I guess they didn't surrender. <clears throat> but they're never going to be the same. So, I mean, I have zero, zero monies. 
right? So just didn't get to the uh, to them fast enough. And the thing is, we were about to do fairly well, I think, with uh, the Germans once I got this headquarters unit over here, right? So I was just going to bring that guy down, we'll move that guy over, or vice versa. Either way, it was going to be okay. Uh, this guy was going to, he's right there. Oh, it looks like they did surrender. So yeah, it's pretty much over now. Wasn't going to happen unless... Yeah, they surrendered. Okay, not a problem. So it's over. Uh, we'll just see how we would have done here. Too bad this was quite, kind of fun going on, but now that he's taken that, it's it's history, right? So we'll go ahead and hit him. Take those two. Take it for two more and move on in. Try to go over here. So if Nairobi goes down, do all these cities go down or not? I'm not sure. We'll go ahead and move a little closer. He's going to go ahead and move south as quickly as possible. This guy would head in this general direction. Yeah, that's okay. This guy would head in this general direction. You could stay there for the turn. You'd be good up here. You would definitely leave. Let's get you repaired. How far can I go? So yeah, this is unfortunate, right? So I would have enjoyed continuing to play this one. Uh, we're, it was just getting interesting. Hold on. I might be able to force march that guy. Yeah, should have force marched him too. Maybe next time. Um, this was going to get interesting for sure. Uh, but not so much right now. Now it's pretty much uh, a done deal. So... Yeah, but it was fun. It was fun. I enjoyed this game very, very much. Uh, the uh, the outcome could have been better. Uh, the mistake, of course, was losing Japan. Uh, with the American onslaught and all the Russians heading back towards... Uh, Europe, uh, this is no longer a viable game. So we're just going to go ahead and call it here. A uh, couple of major lessons learned. Obviously, uh, make sure that you don't lose Denmark, right? That, that's a biggie. Um, that was a biggie. Uh, that was one. Lesson two, keep some stuff in Japan. Should have done that. That's a biggie. Uh, lesson three. I really enjoyed uh, the Mediterranean game here. And even the African game, although I think I could have done this a little quicker. <laughs> uh, would have been nice. Oh, enemy contact. I hate that when that happens. Now I'm back. In any case, it was a good game. Uh, I should have been more aggressive with the Germans. I should have kept my tanks together, I think. Uh, that would have helped out. We'll reinforce that guy. I had plenty of, I mean, I had almost 800 here, so that was pretty good. Um, I, I don't know if I like the Stugs or not, the uh, anti-tanks. I do like the armored train. I do like the artillery. Um, the sub-battle is interesting, however... They tend to die a lot, so you spend a lot of money on research, and then they don't survive it, right? So, like, he's not going to survive it. He's got to go back, and he's going to probably die in there because he'll get aired to death. The air power for the, uh, for the Allies is huge, very huge.
In any case, I think we're going to call it. Uh, we will be playing a game. Oh, excuse me. I was looking for the menu here. Uh, so I've been told I should turn off quick animations. So we're going to do that now. Okay. What are the advanced settings? Uh, headquarters, attachments, escort range. Yeah, that's all good. I might turn on the national morale bars just to see what they look like. Okay. So, oh, okay. Up here, there's the national morale bars. That's interesting. Yeah, again, I think that um, losing Japan is the end of that. I mean, it'll take a while for him to move all his units, but he'll just start operating them all over here. This is now going to be lost because he'll have a, a, a dearth of units that'll be able to attack me, right? So that's not going to be fun for me either. Um, the Axis uh, Field Artillery down here did great. The uh, So did the air. Uh, the armor was fantastic, even though it's still level 2. I wish I would have been able to upgrade it at one point. Yeah, see, I didn't even get a chance to kill it, but... All right, I did end up killing it. So this, this could have been uh, more fun quickly. Uh, I think I would put him in there and then one, two, three, four, five, six, jump into Tehran the following turn. That would have been good. However, it's just not going to work out that way. Okay, so good job uh, to, uh, to Harry for pulling that one off. That's great. I think I did great with the Italians. I think I did okay with the Germans. Not great because I didn't take Moscow. Uh, and I did not hold Denmark. That's something that's definitely going to have to happen next time. There's going to be some additional units up here for sure in the next game I play with the Axis. So I've got a game with um, Old Crow Balthazar, Mike Balthazar, coming up. I will be the Allies. And um, that'll probably post sometime mid to end of April. We'll start posting that because obviously we don't want to do it too soon and see each other's turns or that somebody might chat about it in the comments. Um, I believe I'm going to have a game against Good Games as well. I'll have to get in touch with him and see what he wants to do. Harry, good game. Um, for everybody else watching, sorry that uh, it ended this way. I wish that uh, it had not. I know it could have been a lot more interesting. I know this was more interesting than the Epe Cape game, but for now, I'm out.